Five on the clock. Culver working inside. Tough finish, but gets it to go. Welcome to Austin, Texas. Been effective from shooting the basketball, especially from distance and defending. Good drive by Coleman to set up Mitru Long. And Mitru Long gets it to go. Actually playing for Bob Huggins, a guy that expects so much. The ball is stripped, but the get back from Andrew Gordon and the put back as well. One of the little things that you miss when you lose a Dats Miles, Javon Carter. And there he is working in the post, Derek Colbert. They've really struggled to get their guys the basketball position to score. West with a quick three, cannot get it. Culver spinning way out with the reach. The length of Derek Culver, so impressive here. Went back to Houston for another round of chemo, hoping to get him back later this month as Bolden drops it in just to see his presence is truly uplifting. Regardless of what team you cheer for. That ball thrown away. West and Bolden want to run. Bolden from Huggins was counting on this season to score the ball and do it at a high level. Roach with the drive, the rejection from Ahmad. So Mountaineers once again within two, trying to get over that threshold. Coleman over Ahmad. What a finish there from Matt Coleman. Mitru Long thought about it, had two defenders in his face. Oh, the circus shot inside for Mitru Long. Mitru Long getting to the rim, and how about this finish? Acrobat against Clemson, 9 of 11 for Williamson. Meanwhile, Bolden has his shot rejected from Hayes, and it's corralled by Roach, but they will say out of bounds on Texas. Ahmad gets his own miss. Coleman doing an excellent job of knifing through that zone. Active cutter. Three on the clock. Coleman, 4-3, got it! Well, def definitely not the zone offense you draw up. Matt Coleman going and making the biggest play of the game thus far. The step back three on an incredibly good defender, Wes Harris. It was a nice job defending right there, but better offense. 2-0 and oh to start Big 12 play for the first time since the 2010-2011 season. You look at it, two quality wins here for Texas. You beat Kansas State, now you get West Virginia.